here is your one-stop shop for the SteelSeries Arctis 7 wireless headset. So I've had this headset for about three years now and it is still going strong. I know one of the biggest selling points for me that's justified my purchase over time has been the this little like elastic band. So when I actually put it on, you can see that this top part is not directly touching my head. That little band supports it from, you know, giving me that head dent. And there might be times where, you know, I might just wanna have the headset on. I can go ahead and put it like this. I can turn those ear cups uh, over to the side. If I wanna go like this, I can do stuff like that. However you want to use it, if I wanna keep one ear out, I easily can, and it'll be just fine like that. Stick around because at the end of the video, I'll go ahead and show you what the microphone quality sounds like on this thing on my own PC. And to be able to use this as an actual wireless headset, you need to make sure you connect the little USB dongle that comes. I have it mounted under my desk, but I have also have it directly connected to my PC. So one of my PC USB cables, it goes directly down all the way. And like I said, I have it mounted underneath my desk. That's what makes it wireless. To actually charge the wireless headset, you get this micro USB cable with it and it connects through this little plug right here. So let's go ahead and plug that in right there. And now it is officially charging. And plus you actually know it's charging when this starts glowing red, the little microphone part. It does come with the cables, but if you wanna use wired, you can also connect it through that 3.5 millimeter jack or that micro USB B cable. And also on the back, we have a volume adjustment knob as well as a mute button. And on the right side, we have our main power button. You'll know that's on when you just hold it down and it'll make a little beep and then you're all set to go. And we also have this little adjustment knob where if you wanna have more of your volume towards your game or more of your volume towards your party. And keep in mind that this strap is adjustable. So if you have a bigger head or you just want more cushion in between your head. So if I hold it right now, yes, it touches. But when my head's actually on, it's, it probably has this much room. So if I wanted more room, I would just go ahead and tighten this little strap. Now for the microphone test. And microphone's on. And this is the audio quality you can expect with this SteelSeries Wireless Arctis 7. Now, this is the microphone. As you can see, it's adjustable. So if I want to push it a bit out, you can see what happens to the audio quality, or if I want to put it a bit closer, you can see that I get a lot more louder. So keep that in mind, find your sweet spot, and then you're usually good from there. But also one last thing, keep in mind that from that transmitter that makes this headset actually wireless, you can only last up to 40 feet away. So if I go 41 feet away, then this microphone and headset will not work. And as you can see, it's kind of hard to see, but this little gap right here, you can see it's not fully touching my head. This is not touching my head at all. That top, um, you know, harder plastic part, it's that little band that I was talking about at the beginning of the video. So even more of a reason to have a more comfortable headset. And like I said, I've had this thing for three years and it's been going perfectly strong.